John Lundstrom is the best on earth. Born a Barisic is a torpish. Welcome back to Fog Football's latest dish. It is the greatest football channel on the, the on the on the satellite dishes. Can we go? Can we fire dish in there twice? I don't know. Maybe it was quite pish. But John Lundstrom, born a Barisic, finally. There's, a, there's the... a reason why that song you just came up with there never gets chanted at Ibrox. What John Lundstrom? No, but whatever. My wee one. Right. Well, John Lundstrom's days, good days, are well behind him. Ever since that Leipzig goal, that's where it peaked, right? That's where it peaked for Big John, and it's sadly... Wait, it was good this season? Right, for like two months when he wanted a contract. I'm not buying that. Doing it for the good of the club bullshit. He, I don't know, man. The guy, guy's money-orientated, and he, he's been linked with web switch, but it looks like he's agreed a deal in principle to join Turkish Super League side Trabonspor. Now, I will get into Borna Barisic in a minute, but with John Lundstrom, it looks like a three-year deal that would take him up to his 33 years of age. Would losing John Lundstrom be massive for Rangers? Well, he's a starting 11 player, isn't he? Like, so he's... Yeah, it's time to go, though. You know Gress, they retired. Remember, Rangers signed him like for £2 million about six years ago. Who? Gresta. Eros Gresta. No? No. How do you spell Albanian it? Albanian guy. Uh, G-R-E-Z-D-A. I remember they signed him for like the Croatian League. He nah. scored like one goal. A nope. couple of mil. Anyway, well, he's retired from football at the age of 29, which is bizarre. But John Lundstrom, one year older, still What's kick... What's I got to do with John Lundstrom? I thought, just thought that guy came in about the same time as Goldson and Barisic, who we'll, we'll get to in a wee minute, by the way. But John Lundstrom... I mean, Rangers losing him on a free, right? It's poor business. But, again, John Lundstrom's one of those guys, right, that was hard done by in the sense of if Conor Goldson doesn't make ma that mistake, right, and Rangers win that Europa League, think of the amount of Rangers players' careers, right, that would have been held so much higher if Rangers won the Europa League. Yeah, and then maybe they could have moved on at a time where they could have got good money for Rangers. Yeah. Like, you look at Bassi and Aribo, that didn't really affect them because they moved on pretty much straight after it, but the players that were a part of that run that stayed on... It's it, just got worse since then, hasn't it? Yeah. I mean, you look at Kent and Morelos, it got worse, they left... Same with our field. I mean, pretty much this summer as well. I mean, you're looking at pretty much an identical summer for Rangers where they're just losing a bunch of players on freeze. And what happened the last season, we've learned. They've no, they've learned nothing. Like, why not let Barisic go in January? I remember, though, a couple of windows ago, it was like, oh, Roma, bidding 11 million for Borna Barisic. Yeah, those days are long gone. Those days are long gone. But what's weird about this is, is the fact that Barisic and Lundstrom are going to the same club. Now, last season, Kent Morelos were linked with Fenerbahce. Only turned out to be Ryan Kent that was actually going to Fenerbahce. Morelos couldn't find a club until uh, the mighty Santos took him in. And he's been too busy eating the pies while playing GTA. On Los Santos. In Los Santos, sorry. But John Lundstrom, I think yeah, that's him done. That's him done. Nice. Ah, he's, he's finished. Time it, to go. He is finished. I'm glad he's away. It's a shame. I mean, I think there is a player in there. As for Borna Barisic, there's not a player in there. That guy is a fucking shite bag. No heart. Of no. He's a shite bag of the, the highest order. He's like the tin man. But he's made out of pish. Because you know what? His father's like the top man of the, the Croatian mafia. And this guy runs a bit like he, he's got a nappy filled. Didn't know that. Is he actually top man? Aye, he's a top man, aye. There you go. Where you been? Wait, wait, hold on, you didn't know that? Why well, doesn't he get moved back to the Croatian League and then he can dominate that? Well, maybe. Well, he's, he's linked with Trabonspor now. Barisic's deal ain't a three-year deal. It kind of is. It's a two-year deal with the option of an additional year. Um, Borna Barisic, I mean, he still gets picked for Croatia, but it's done. It's it's. There's no way. Like I think in the past you've seen like with Rangers players... I don't think Conor Goldson's... I think Conor Goldson's probably got another year and then Rangers fans will be completely done with him. But do you not agree? Do you think Borna Barisic has been riding this yeah, game of I, shite I, for I, too long and, and that's it? It's yeah, good, it's for, me, for me it's done with Barisic, unfortunately. Uh, I know some people are against Goldson and Lundstrom, but I think they could still have a future at Rangers. Yeah, I don't see Barrett. I think Barisic has to go this season. No, absolutely, and I, I, I just, I look, at, I look at the crop of players right now. I think who comes under the Barisic banner with him. I wouldn't say there's many. I think Scott Wright falls under that fold. Like, but see, I don't think Scott Wright is like, quote unquote, 
disliked as much as Barisic, Lundstrom and Goldson, but he's just simply not good enough. Like, let, no, let, let's call a spade a spade, right? See Goldson, Lundstrom and Barisic, on their day they do start for Rangers. But the problem is, Barisic hasn't had his day in about five years. Scott Wright, well, I, don't, I, I will never actually grasp for the life of me why Rangers even signed Scott Wright. No, it made no sense to me at the time. 50 grand during the 55 season. I mean, here, he's got a league title to his name. If he played 10 games at least, which I'm going to assume he did, but... Like, see, see Rangers, right? What, what, what is the obsession with signing players for Aberdeen that are fucking pants? Like, they signed Greg Stewart. I thought he was all right. But Scott Wright? And then they'll let players like Lewis Ferguson, Calvin Ramsey... Etc. Slip through their fingers. Come ah, on, especially Lewis Ferguson. Right. No, that no, oh, the Lewis Ferguson one's unforgivable, man. Like it, it's funny how they they'll sign like shite players for the teams in the league, but see the players that actually are fucking good in the other like Shankland, Ferguson. Why, why won't they go near them? I, I actually I, I'm baffled, but you know what? I'm glad Lundstrom and Barisic is going, especially Barisic. Right, at least with Lundstrom, like, I mean, I think there's a bit of potential that he could stay and maybe do something, but he's not. I mean, as for what Clement said, he says there's been offers from the club, but there's no agreement yet. I expect he's other offers, yes. I hope he stays. I know he loves to be here. It depends on what you can offer and what other clubs can offer. Well, you know what? I mean, I think John Lundstrom, there's games he looks brilliant and there's games he looks like he's lost about five yards of pace. And uh, for us, that's, he's crossed the line, damn it, John Lundstrom. So until next time, guys, Bona Barisic, John Lundstrom at the team. Unless you want to say anything else on them, Jambo Bear. Nah. Did you take them to hearts? I had take John Lundstrom at hearts. Not Barisic. Alex Cochran <laughs> doing too good of a job there. I mean, I'd maybe, but realistically, I don't know, Barisic, like the kind of money he'd be wanting, I don't know if it, it would be worth it. And um, we've received a comment from Brian McMahon. He says Rangers will be filling their nappies at Parkhead. So, like Borna Barisic every game then? Oh, well, there you go. Borna Barisic special coming at Celtic Park. No, I mean, why would you want Barisic your heart strike? I'll tell you why. Because see, before every big game, he, he, he feigns injury. So he doesn't have to play. Imagine being the son of a top mafia boss, man. Your arse collapses. Should like you not that. be grateful to him then that he feigns injuries there? He doesn't need to play? <laughs> I mean, maybe we should, like, but that's, that's pathetic. That's not very good. Look, at Barisic, he's had a decent Rangers career. He won a medal. He'll be remembered for title 55. Could have been remembered no, as well but once upon a for time, a Europa League medal, do you know but once didn't a, happen. Do you not think once upon a time, though, that Barisic and Tav were almost considered on the same level? Die? What harmed? I'd say up to a couple of years ago they were considered. Yeah, I'd say during title 55, I looked at the fullback situation as equal, and obviously Tav still got the goals and assists, right? But I thought Barisic was good. But the problem is, since then, I don't know what's happened, man. Shadow the player he once was. Anyway, till next time, peace.